ask you for an electric bill. Um, I know you won't have a water bill because... Okay, so here's the phone number. That's okay, you can sit right there if you want to. Or I can put the number in for you if you want me to. I have never seen onions grow on the top. That's incredible. So they need to know a lot of personal information from me, like where I live, how much money I make. They insist on it. This is practically like a, um, a food stamps office. Yet they have, they say they have auditors that they need to report to in case something doesn't look right. And they can't divulge who the auditors are, but I'm, I'd put the pieces together and say it's the, the donors or even the secondhand harvest that is their auditors. All right, checking out Tree T Rock Historical Site. I'm sure there's a sign that explains what it's all about. All right, so they have some some uh, problems, some crime problems at, at the Tree T Rock. I recorded it on my ca other camera to read it. Tree T Rock Park. I was told that there's uh, like a, a homeless encampment or and there's caves for homeless to sleep in. <clears throat> Seems hard to believe since it's such a small area. All right, so it goes down, down quite a ways, heading towards the highway. <laughs> caves. It's a well-worn trail. This is a nice area to get out of the sun. I mean, it's shining bright at 6 p.m., but it's, you get in the shade quick. So it leads to maybe the highway that goes over uh, train tracks. And of course, homeless sleep underneath a, a lot of bridges. Looks like that could be the case here. You know, what's interesting to me is I get told that there's all this homeless activity in some places and I see nothing. There's no signs of it. It's like, then I have to ask, uh, was, there, was there a problem in the past? Or is it just somebody's, oh man, that's slippery. Oh, just trying to. Okay, see it's train tracks. Alright, I think I'm going back up a different way since it's... What are those guys? Those guys just cut across onto the railroad tracks with fishing poles. There might be a secret access fishing spot on the river. So the police say that I should just hang out on the, the sidewalk if I want to use the library after hours. However, at 7.30 a.m. I don't get a signal on the sidewalk. Alright, I'm almost done eating this, but I'll just make a comment. Up. Sugar snap peas, hummus, and yogurt are a pretty good combination. Well, I tried to record this homeless guy and it failed. Yeah, I fail at recording things sometimes. Post files. We got a reading sign. I'm gonna go read. Wow. Bathrooms. All right. Total bull. I'm gonna bring my bicycle anyway. Total bull that they got that rule. 
I guess I think it's more against riding it than walking it. All right, five to 12. So this is where the dam is, they say. I guess that's nearby here somewhere. There's some concrete that might be evidence. Uh, okay. This geology. Oh, you can go up there. Part of the dam in some way. Not much for water going through this channel now. It looks ma probably man made. And then the other side. Alright, so it used to be some kind of a wooden structure. And it's incredible. I'm gonna switch over to my my zoom camera. It's quite a view from here though, just looking from a distance, see if I can capture anything close up. I just say that this uh, walk bridge also feels uh, a little flimsy. All right, I'm not gonna climb too far and get away from my car too much, or my bicycle too much. Just wanna see the top edge of this yeah so you got some potential thieves over there dog walking thieves yeah on top is just uh, another view they got a lot of fence water levels change rapidly and they warn you way up here i don't really see how you can find evidence of the ch rapid change of water levels here kind of evidence i guess Very clear water, there's fish around that suck sound. Looks kind of clear, clean. No fungus, no algae seriously growing. I don't know if they're taking measures to prevent it. They probably are. The Dart Brothers. That looks pretty neat. It'd be nice to have one that you could walk through see what it's all about if it's worth it another angle of the dam dam remnants put a lot of signs up around here what are these chains there's chains to the rocks <clears throat> lots lots and lots of reading signs Oh, they talk about the bridge. All right. Power. Yeah. It's fairly new. 1929, they say. I'm gonna switch over to the, yeah. So dangerous. Oh, uh, 
So dangerous. These, this has to be made of logs. See the logs? And then they switched it over. So you can go down a little ways. Maybe I'll. I guess you return to the park here. See the bridge in the distance. Lots of reading. Wow. Is there a sign over there? Let me just capture this dam. Well, can't really see too much. Not much to see. Dam ahead, keep away. So it's for the boaters who have had problems. Okay. The second sawmill. I guess it's right on the edge over here. You see some wooden planks, some board fence. Might be some remnant. Remnant. There's a remnant over here of concrete structure. So they got a permanent construction tower here. They're saying that this concrete thing was maybe here. It's just used to serve as a tower, as a, whatever they call it, a, a winch or whatever, to reach over to the, the dam, take things over. It'd be nice to get a better idea of what it really looked like. I don't think those pictures showed. So pretty much this dam ensures that there's not gonna be any fish that survive. <laughs> I mean, the dam on the, on the Columbia River claimed to have 90% survival rate. I don't think this one's quite 90%. This one doesn't look like it would be even, even half, even, even close to a half. I think most fish die. It would be nice to have an explanation of how the fish, how they deal with the fish trying to migrate. They probably don't even care. Columbia River is the only place you can get salmon now. Where do the fish... Yeah, look at this. This is the warning for us. What about the warnings for the fish? If only there was some kind of warning device to, for the fish to say, Look out! You're gonna get chewed up! What the heck? So this goes to the drive bridge. It's another sign. Uh, yeah, somebody's blocking it. Corbin Ditch. So that's the Corbin ditch down there, all concrete, 